Hello everyone. Today we'll take a look at how to use the if function. The if function lets you uh, specify a condition and if that condition is true then you can specify one kind of action or one kind of value and if the condition is false then you can specify another kind of action or value. Now in this data we have a simple table with two columns. One is the zone east, west, north or south and another is the sales for each zone. 61, 43, 74, and 14. Now we want to say that if the sales for a zone is greater than or equals 50, then it's good. That is, if the sales for a zone is at least 50 or more, then it is good. If not, it's bad. So we get started with the if function equals if within parenthesis. So we want to say if the value in the cell B4 is greater than or equals 50 then we want to say that it's good now if you take a look at the if function it has um, three arguments or three inputs that you need to give them uh, the function the first one is your condition the logical test as it is called and the logical test is whether b4 is greater than or equals 50 that is whether the value contained in the cell b4 is greater than or equals 50 if that condition is true, then the second argument, which is the value if true, will be outputted or printed out by the if function. In this case, the second value is the value if true is quote unquote good. It's a string here, which is a, a string good, but it could also be a number. And if the logical test is false, then the if function will output the string bad which in this case is um, also the value if false. Now we drag, uh, copy drag this uh, function all the way um, to the rest of the cells. We don't have to retype it, which is one of the neat uh, labor saving devices that's available in Excel. Um, we can just um, click on the fill handle in the bottom right corner of the cell C4 and drag this formula all the way down to the cells C5, C6, and C7. And that way our formula will be copied and uh, the if function condition will be applied uh, in the rest of the rows. So here I'm just clicking on the fill handle in the bottom right corner um, of the cell C4 and I'm dragging this formula all the way to the rest of the cells. And if you click individually in each of the other cells, you can see that the appropriate if function has been applied to it. And uh, each cell now has a value good or bad as appropriate, depending on whether the sales for that particular region is above 50 or below 50. So that's all for now. Uh, thanks a lot. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks.